Buenas, bienvenidos, bienvenidas, bienvenidos. Vamos a continuar con Keep Shake. Quinta parte, creo. Eh, capítulo segunda prueba. Habíamos conseguido uno de los ingredientes que necesitábamos para hacer la poción para la transformación de Zack. No sé si teníamos todos los demás. Bueno, tenemos también pendientes las dos pruebas de tres. Ahí hicimos una. Y ver cómo continúa todo esto, porque pensamos que ahí puede estar ya el, el final o descubrir qué es lo que está ocurriendo. Subimos por la derecha. Vale, estas escaleras a tope y vamos a ir a la cocina. Eh, no sé si recordáis dónde está, yo no me acuerdo, así que vamos a intentar llegar a ella. Bueno, creo que hay un par de caminos para llegar hasta la cocina. Pero vamos a hacer este, ¿vale? Vamos a bajar. Vamos hasta el puzzle del Minotauro. O sea, bueno, el juego del Minotauro. Que si tal vez recordéis, ¿no? Es un punto clave. Es todo recto. Ahí está. A veces nos cambian la visión y se ve raro. Subimos por arriba. Subimos, subimos. Pasamos por la puerta. Elvander told me a student came in his glade a few days ago. Elvander? The woodland creature has a name? Yes, and he was very nice with me, so stop calling him a creature. As I was saying. Criatura, no está mal dicho, ¿no? Only time will tell. One thing is certain. I promised Elvander I would find the culprit who tore a piece of his bark and make him come apologize. And I will. It is too sack. Entramos. Vale, y si pasamos el comedor. Bajando por aquí. Que era. A ver si nos deja. Ahí, por aquí está la cocina, ¿no? Es esto ya. Tenemos que ir a mirar el fuego. Sí. There has to be one in this kitchen. Está abajo en la bodega. Vamos a... Ah, no nos dejas, pero están buscando algo. It looks like we're out of luck. Ah, I can't believe we can't find a stupid cauldron. We need to drag the cauldron we found in the wine cave all the way to this fireplace if we want to brew your potion. Exacto, ese es. Vale, sí que se recordaban, sí que lo sabían, pero iban a buscar uno por aquí cerca, claro. Tiene sentido. Eh, aquí. A veces está complicado, ¿eh? Dar en la zona correcta. Vamos aquí. Estamos en la parte de abajo. Estaba creo que aquí abajo, ¿no? Vale, antes de darle al caldero. Eh... Bueno, no sé, vamos a darle al caldero. Es que no sé cómo vamos a subirlo por aquí. Hey, that's exactly what we need to brew the potion. For sure it's a cauldron, but how will we bring it all the way up? Exacto, ahí está el problema. We will have to sweat a bit. Un poco. Oh, se que lo han movido. 
gosh, this thing is heavy. Was it? What? ¿Qué pasa? Y ahora, ahora habría que darle para que suba. Y es que está muy justo todo. Tal vez era donde la alguien. Sí, tiene que ser aquí. Le damos. Ahí va el caldero. Pero solo está ahí. Pues nada. Esto lo queda. Ah, aquí está el caldero. Creía que era el mismo montacarga, no era el mismo. The cauldron is ready to go up in the pantry. Pues démosle. Let's go drag this cauldron from the hoist to the fireplace now. Ahora hay que pegar toda la vuelta para volver a la cocina. Por aquí ya no podemos ir. ¿Esto dónde es? Oh, vale, vamos por la brecha. Oh, esperar, creo que había una salida por aquí. Se puede ir por varios sitios, el caso es salir de aquí y llegar otra vez a la cocina. Yo voy a hacerlo por aquí. No sé si será más vuelta o menos. Pero vamos a ir por el jardín de aquí abajo. Porque ahora podemos subir por aquí. Y quiero recordar que no estaba muy lejos en realidad, ¿no? ¿Veis? Está aquí. Creo que es la forma más rápida de llegar. Vale, por ahí está el caldero. Por aquí. Hay que llevarlo hasta allá. Ahí está. Le damos al caldero. Ah, es fácil, está fácil. Gosh, it's about time. I was afraid I wouldn't be strong enough to drag it to this fireplace. I would have loved to help you, but this wolf body doesn't have any hands. Right. Le volvemos a dar. Finally, I've been waiting for this for way too long. Este momento. I'll be turned into a powerful and fearsome dragon, and nobody will make fun of me anymore. You mean turned back into a dragon? I. Uh, Yeah, I mean turned back into a dragon. Exactly like I was before those students turned me into a wolf. Qué mentira uh -huh. Okay, what do I have to do now? Okay, boil the yulak leaves until the water takes their color. Then, add just the skin of the nigelus fruit and make sure to remove all of its pulp before dropping it in the cauldron. Finally, 
Slowly mix the heat and flour petals into the brew and recite the following formula. Shapus infinitus hedia eulachus nigelus tenestus. Well, it looks like it should be ready. Haha! <laughs> as soon as I'm a dragon, I'll be able to get back at those students who locked me up. What? I, I changed my mind. Don't drink this potion. It was a bad idea. Zack? This potion doesn't seem to work. You're still a wolf. Are, are you are you all right? Zack, answer me. I better get some cool water to wake him up. Oh gosh, no, not now. Tuvo que pasar un momento. My daughter. <coughs> Mother, don't talk. Keep your strength. We need all of your energy to fight the disease. We need you, Mother. I am one of the most powerful wizards on this continent. I have access to the most incredible knowledge ever known. Yet, I can't find a cure to save the one who means everything to me. Were all of these years I spent acquiring this knowledge just a waste of time? <coughs> I can't stand to see her suffering. Nathaniel, Celeste is <coughs> exhausted. Take her to her, <coughs> to her room. She needs some rest. No. Father, can I sleep here with Mom? Father? Father! Before Mother died, you were always there for anyone in need of help, Father. Celeste! I'm here! Answer me! But since she's gone, it seems your happiness left with her. Since that day, you never looked at me the same, Father. Why? My poor Celeste. What happened to you? Huh? One of the trial room doors. Zack, what happened during my vi- The potion! I almost forgot he fainted after drinking it! Zack, where are- Hey, hello little kitty! What are you doing alone out here? Are you lost like me? Do you know that besides my wolf companion, you're the only living creature I've seen in this academy? Talking about Zack, I better get going if I want to make sure nothing happened to him. Well, if you call being transformed into a cat nothing, then your wish has been granted. Zack! How? Oh, gosh, the potion didn't work right. No, it didn't. I'm so sorry about this. I told you I had no idea how to make a potion. Looks like I won't be able to take you to the upper part of the school after all. What are we going to do now? I don't want to stay a cat forever! We must find someone! The only way to get to the second trial is to go onto the roof and enter the trial room through the broken window. What? Are you crazy? This means walking on the school's roof! Ahora es un gato. Un gatito adorable. Y malvado. Bueno. Pues nada. Ya no es un lobo, ahora es un gato. Me gusta. Bueno, hemos visto la visión de Celeste, pues cuando perdió a su madre, pues que su padre se quedó así, pues ya, ya lo sabíamos más o menos todo esto. Bueno, vamos a entrar a la sala de la prueba.
Miramos la palanca de nuevo y... Le damos... No hace nada. We need to find a window leading to the roof of the academy if we want to go further. Pues salimos de aquí. Nos vamos. Vamos a intentar llegar al puzzle del Minotauro desde aquí. Que es saliendo. El puzzle del Minotauro donde estaba... Por aquí, sí que hemos llegado lejos, tú. Nos han hecho dar aquí un paseo largo, ¿eh? Esperamos a Zack. No nos dejan abrir hasta que no pase. ¿Qué eres? Un gato. Ay. Madre mía, nos tenemos que acostumbrar, ¿eh? Vamos para allá. Uy, ¿qué pasó? Debes enviar a Zack. Anda, nunca le había dado aquí, le he dado sin querer. El bloque del camino que conduce a la prueba. Nos dan una pista. Bueno, nos están diciendo a dónde ir. Vale. Pues ya sabéis, allí tenemos que ir. Oh, no lo sabía, me doy cuenta ahora. Vaya, vaya. Están muy bien las pistas estas. Pues si te quedas atascada. O oh, bueno, quieres que no sea tan complicado el juego, ¿no? A veces apetece jugar tranquilamente para enterarte bien de la historia, ¿no? Y disfrutar de ella. Vale, hemos llegado aquí. De aquí, pues, tenemos que ir a la cocina, aquí arriba. Vamos por el comedor y todo esto para llegar a la cocina. Al fondo. A la derecha. Bien, entonces tenemos que mirar esto de aquí. Ahí es. I do. In your cat form, you could walk there easily, I'm sure. No, no, no! I will not go on the roof and risk my life! Then we are stuck down here. You might never be a dragon again, and some people might even be in danger, but we... Why do you always find the good argument? How can I say no and not feel guilty now? I'll try it, even though I doubt I'll succeed. Just give me a minute to gather my courage. I'm sure you'll do great, Zack. Pobre Zack, que tiene miedo a las alturas. If I fall, promise that you'll tell the others I did my best when you find them. I... I promise. I'll wait in the trial room. See you there. Don't look down, Zack. Keep looking straight ahead. Just forget there's nothing beneath you and... Birds! I should catch one. That'd be tasty. Ew, what was I thinking? This damned cat body is taking over my mind. <laughs> Whoa, awesome! A dragon! <sighs> If only I really was a dragon, I wouldn't be afraid of heights. Was he? In fact, I, I probably wouldn't be afraid of anything. This is way too high for me. I can't go on. Oh well, at least I tried. Zach, you can't let Lydia down. She did so much for you. You have to do this so we can find out what is really going on in the Academy. Come on, Zach. Be brave for once in your life. You can do this. You are. Whoa! Don't look down! Don't look down! <laughs> been gone for a long time now. Where is he? I would feel so bad if something happened to him. <laughs> Never mind. Maybe he fell? 
Oh no, what if he fell and... Zack, that's not funny. <laughs> you should have seen your face. I know that was mean, but I really need to laugh after walking across that roof. Never do that again. I was really worried. I managed to overcome my fear of heights, but it wasn't easy, you know. But I felt like I owed you for all you did for me, so I did it. And now, let's see if we can make this bridge move. De acuerdo, le tengo que dar aquí. Probaré con esta palanca. Zack tiene que hacer algo. Echar un vistazo por aquí, no. Vamos a ver, Zack tiene que hacer algo. Lo que está claro es que tenemos que pasar aquí enfrente con Zack. ¿Vale? Eso es lo primero, es la parte fácil. Y le damos aquí a la palanca. Probaré con esta palanca. Pues creo que Lidia está aquí abajo. Volvemos a darle a la palanca. Pero esta vez elegimos Lidia. Ahora con Lidia subimos las escaleras. Le damos a la palanca. Y escogemos el Zack. Con Zack venimos aquí. Y le damos a la palanca. Bueno, en principio ya pueden unirse. Pero creo que esto hay que hacerlo sin juntarlos, ¿vale? Cada uno tiene que ir un poco por su cuenta. Así que vamos a ver cómo lo hacemos. Ahora pasamos a ser Lidia. Y creo que Lidia le tiene que dar aquí a la palanca. Entonces, para hacer esto, tienen que haber dos personas o dos seres que se puedan darle a la palanca y se comuniquen entre sí. Le volvemos a dar y pasamos a hacer sac. Vamos a bajar por aquí. Se nos deja bien. Y tenemos que pulsar. Estas no hay que tocarlas, ¿vale? Hay que ir a esta palanca de aquí. Y hay que darle a la palanca dos veces. Una. Y una segunda vez. Bueno, y ahora ya lo tendríamos hecho. Pasamos a ser Lidia. Bajamos. Le damos a la palanca. Como que está demasiado lejos, tía. Y vamos a ser Zack. Y como Zack le volvemos a dar. ¡Ey! Pero, ¿qué os pasa? Antes no dices eso. Le volvemos a dar. Pasamos a ser Lidia y está hecho. Ahí está. We did it, Zach. Without you overcoming your fear, we never would have made it. 
Yeah, well, you tried to brew my potion, so I helped you get to the trial of wisdom. I don't owe you anything now. Huh? I didn't help you to get something in return. Hmm. Aquí está la prueba. If this second trial is as easy as the first one, we'll be in the upper part of the academy in no time. No, 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 no. the dragon scales before you've killed him, Lydia. What? It's just something my grandfather used to say. Isn't it odd for a dragon to say that? <laughs> for a dragon? Uh, never mind. Just concentrate on your trial. Está claro que no es un dragón. Te aúlla sin que lo veas y te agaricia sin tocarte. Te susurra en noche de estrellas aunque sin nada que contarte. Pues este acertijo es de uno de los libros. Vale, esto es muy complicado. Y los libros los vamos moviendo con esto. Este acertijo es el del libro Aetern. Que es uno de color blanco con un dibujo gris. Vamos a buscarlo. A ver, ¿este cómo se llama? Este es Undar. Y este es Aeter, la runa del cielo. Entonces se supone que esto será el cielo. Te aúlla sin que lo veas y te acaricia sin tocarte. Te susurra en noche de estrellas aunque sin nada que contarte. Un poco complicado, ¿eh? Le damos aquí. Ahí se coloca. Vale, es este. Y ahora... Tardándole aquí. Ahí está. Vale, con este movemos los acertijos. A mi alrededor nunca solo estarás, pero cuando me oculte tu amigo se irá. Y tenemos el cielo. Voy a intentarlo hacer sin... La, runa, la naturaleza. La runa de la energía. El fuego. Esta es Kiros. A mi alrededor nunca solo estarás, pero cuando me oculte tu amigo se irá. No tiene sentido esto. Pero bueno, allá vamos. Este es Kiros. Pasamos. El tercero. Que es... Blanda cual musgo, dura cual roca, fuente de vida, fuente de muerte. Cuando a tu último baile llega la hora, a mis a mis qué 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 rápido. A mis maternales brazos vendrás a cogerte. Este creo que es la naturaleza, ¿eh? Es Dría. Dría es. A ver si no me equivoco. Es el mismo, el símbolo del árbol. Este. Este creo que es Dría. Sí, la runa de la naturaleza. Ay, perdón. Vamos a darle. Lo pasamos. Está en todas partes, pero no puede cogerse. Lo tienes, pero a él le pertenece. Será tu fin si por desgracia lo pierdes. El espíritu. Es Lund. 
Es Slund. A ver cuál era Slund. Es Lund. La runa del espíritu. Sí. Ahí está. Ahí está, lo hemos conseguido. Algunos no tienen mucho sentido, ¿eh? Como para mí no lo tiene. ¿Y eso les queda una prueba. Es un estudiante. Maldito Zack. Pues ya hemos terminado el capítulo de segunda prueba. Ahora empezaría el capítulo de activando las puertas. Una vez terminemos con la segunda prueba, nos vamos al vestíbulo. Así que volvemos atrás. Vamos a volver por aquí. Pasamos la puerta. Bueno, cuando nos dejen. Venga, Zack. Ah, ya no tiene miedo. ¿O qué? ¿O oh, sí? No, creo que sí, ha llegado más tarde. Mm, vamos por aquí. El vestíbulo está por aquí. Una vez... Estamos de vuelta en el vestíbulo. Nos vamos detrás del dragón. Para pasar por las rejas estas. Subimos. Vamos para arriba, para arriba. Y tenemos que llegar aquí, hicimos la primera prueba. Tenemos que llegar a la puerta que encontramos, que es la tercera prueba. Pasamos de esto. Y seguimos subiendo. No debe estar muy lejos, si no recuerdo mal. Aquí está. Esta es. La tercera prueba. Supuestamente última. Entramos. Well, where is this last trial? It will start any moment now. What? Zach, speak louder. I can't hear you. Oh no, I know this sound. Huh. What the fuck? Estamos en juego, sí. There's someone stuck in there. Somebody help her, please. Ayúdala tú. Don't worry, little girl. Everything will be fine. Vale, vamos a darle. Don't worry, little girl. Everything will be fine. Que no hace nada. Tenemos que ir, tenemos que ir. 
There is no way I'm getting closer to this burning house. I won't get any closer to this burning house. I won't get any closer to this burning house. Otro sitio. Solo tenemos estos dos. Alternamos. Hang in there, little one. Someone will. No, no, no! Why are you making me go through this again? I'll die if someone doesn't come to help me. I can't save myself. Es ella de pequeña. Nathaniel, where are you? Hang on, Lydia. Someone will save you soon. I can't save her. Me. Don't panic. Nathaniel will be here soon. He's the one who rescued me when I was young. And this is exactly what happened, so he will be here soon. <laughs> if Nathaniel doesn't come, the house will collapse. What should I do? Vale, que ir alternando entre la puerta y, y Lidia, la pequeña. Nathaniel, hurry up! Where is he? How come he isn't here? That's it, I can't wait longer. Who knows what will happen if I let myself die in here? <risa> Por fin Le ha costado, eh Y esa era la tercera prueba, entonces Lydia, you're back Why did you leave me, Zach? I didn't I was by your side all the time but you couldn't see me. The candidate who passes this trial has to do it on his own. I'm glad to see you managed to overcome your worst fear, Lydia. Why didn't you tell me this is what would happen? And how come you know what this trial is all about? The Guardian told us, and I didn't want to make you remember it in case you changed your mind. Mm. Nothing will prevent me from finding Celeste and figuring out what is going on in this damn school. But I could have prepared myself if you had told me. I found myself back years ago when my house was on fire. But this time, Nathaniel didn't come to save me. I was all by myself. It... it's over now, Lydia. You passed the trials, so the Guardians should let us pass. Vale. La tercera prueba. La más difícil. Emocionalmente. La más fácil. En jugabilidad. Vale, solo hay que darle, ir alternando entre la puerta y, y la idea de pequeña y ya está. Vamos a subir. Porque ahora se supone que ya podemos... Pero no se puede terminar aquí. Habrá que hacer más cosas. Eh, eh, no creo que sea importante. A ver qué nos espera. Congratulations, candidate Lydia. You have successfully completed the three trials. Keep in mind that there are no wrong decisions, only consequences. Decisiones buenas o malas, solo consecuencias de tus acciones. By the power invested in us, we now allow you to walk as a student and proceed to the restricted section of the academy. Thank you, Guardians. <sighs> I was dreaming of a different welcome when I set out on this journey. Come on, let's go look for someone who will give me back my true form. And your friend Celeste. <laughs> we only need to step on the teleport disc in the middle of the room to... Teleport disc? What's that? Teleportation is a magical form of transportation. We will disappear from here and magically appear in the upper part of the school. Look. Hola. Zach? Zach? Sí que desaparece en... I know he subitamente. Me, but how much? Can I trust him? What does he really want from me? Huh. Friend or foe, he is definitely not what he pretends to be. Sí. I must. Come on, Lydia. 
Let's go see what Nathaniel is up to. Zach, I already told you. Sorry, I meant let's go find out what is going on in this academy. No, si se fusionan con el teleport. Nueva zona. Nueva, nuevísima zona. Bueno, tendremos otra vez que memorizar un nuevo mapa. De acuerdo, volvemos a probar el teleport. This teleport pad doesn't work. You mean we have no way to escape if we're in danger? That about sums it up. Atrapados aquí. Estamos fuck. Pues nada. Vamos a ver. Oh, ¿esto es otro teleport? Where does this teleport pad lead? I have no idea. I only know that students use them often to move around the school. You never use them? Lydia, maybe you forgot that I'm usually a dragon. I can fly. Right. So, I guess you have no idea why they aren't working either. Exactly. Hmm. Well, one thing is sure, it doesn't work right now. Es lo único que está claro. Vamos, seguimos por aquí. ¿Esta dónde da? Why did you stop? It's all so quiet. We we better be on our guard. Can you tell me where do all these doors lead? Estoy perdidísima. We are in the students' quarters. I remember Celeste's room not being far from here. What? And you're only telling me this now? Sorry. Mm, bueno, vamos a seguir, a ver. Oh. Por aquí o por allí. No lo sé. Pero estoy un poco perdida. A ver, por aquí. Ah, vamos a salir aquí fuera, a ver. This place looks like some sort of classroom. Yep, we are in the herbalism classroom. Students learn how plants can be used in a multitude of magical experimentations here. Qué bien. Oh, podemos bajar. Uf. No sé si nos vamos a perder demasiado, eh. Sí, esta es una clase. Hmm. Aquí hay algo. What are these strange root covered balls? I have no idea. My master wasn't teaching herbalism. What was he teaching? Um, uh, how to identify and use magical items. Esto debe ser un puzzle. Vale, no, esto es, esto es un puzzle que todavía no sabemos cómo resolver. Vámonos de aquí. Vamos a volver atrás. Porque por aquí no era, está claro que me he perdido. Vale. Vamos a volver atrás. Vamos a salir por aquí. Aquí entra el teleport. This teleport pad doesn't work. Ah, no hay nada. Pues no entiendo muy bien dónde tenemos que ir. Oh, ¿y esto? 
Aquí es donde tendríamos que venir. Hay dos dragones. Oh. <risa> Pero hablar con él. Now do you believe me when I say that ghosts do exist? At least it doesn't seem to be following us. I'm sorry I doubted you, Zack. But before today, ghosts were just fairy tales to me. What if he is responsible for everyone's disappearance? We're in great danger. Hurry, let's put as much distance between us and this ghost as possible. Creo que deberías hablar con el fantasma, eh. Pero vamos a volver otra vez. De acuerdo, vamos a ver si hay más caminos. No parece. No. Volvemos otra vez aquí. Que ya habíamos estado antes. Vale, vamos por aquí. Se escuchan ruidos. ¿Qué es esto? Ahora que se ha vuelto esto aquí como de miedo. Una puerta. Será esta la habitación de Celeste. Of course, it would have been too easy for Celeste to be in her room. Sí. And she left no clue that could tell us where she is right now. I'm starting to believe that I will never see her again. I can't stand to keep this to myself anymore. Lydia, there is something I must tell you. Yo soy Celeste. The, the last time I talked to Celeste, she was really sick. Vaya. Talk to her? You know Celeste? Well, not really. We only spoke to each other two or three times and... Where is she? Uh, I don't know. Liar. I swear I don't know where she is. And I bet you don't know what's going on in this school either, huh? Zach, why are you lying to me? I'm not lying. I... Do you really think I'm that stupid? You've been lying to me since I met you. I don't know what you are exactly, but I do know you're not a teacher's familiar. I... Letting you out of that wooden case was a mistake. One that I'll fix right now. Get into. You'll stay locked in there as long as it takes you to tell me the truth about yourself and what is going on in this damn school. Promise me that you will let me out first. Then I'll explain everything. Yeah, claro. Okay, okay. I'll talk first and then you let me out. My name is really Zach, but I'm not a teacher's fam... La historia. I'm so glad that you finally found time for me, father. This view is breathtaking, isn't it? It certainly is, my daughter. I didn't take time to enjoy your presence recently, my dear. I have something to confess, father. But please don't be mad at me. Usually when you ask me that, Celeste, it's because you know I will get mad. So, no, I won't promise anything. All right, father. I... I just wanted to tell you that I found a portrait of Mother in the basement. How could you? I had strictly forbidden you to touch your mother's belongings. I know, but I miss her so much. Elvandar thinks we look so alike we could have been mistaken for sisters. Is it true? Your mother is at peace where she is. Do not disturb her anymore. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have work to do. No! Don't leave yet, father. Stay with me. What have I done to make him act like that?
I have waited long enough. Give it to me now, Zack. Zack? Yes, Master Nathaniel. But why did you not take it yourself? Give it to me now. Finally, no one's mind will be able to hide anything from me. What are you doing, Master Nathaniel? Just like me, you never really knew my daughter. You are of no use to me anymore. Now, forget everything that happened, young Nightingale. Zack Nightingale? Where did I land again? Zack? No me has sorprendido Zach, tanto. I have some questions for you. Oh yeah. I locked him up in Celeste's room. I better find my way back to him quickly before he breaks anything in there. Y quería ser un dragón. ¿Dónde estamos? ¿Qué habrá pasado con Celeste? Pues vamos a salir de aquí. Hay que pasar por aquí. ¿Eh? ¿Qué? Hey, this creature looks just like the one that flew right over me when we opened the door to the study. Sí, no lo he visto antes, no me acuerdo. Estamos en una clase. How is this possible? ¿Dónde está Zack? Oh, me I encanta. Quiero apologizarte a ti, Lydia. I really deserve to be locked up again. You were right. I've lied to you since the first moment we met. I can't tell you how bad I feel about that, especially after everything you've done for me. Zack, please, look at me. ¿Cómo has escapado? How did you escape from Celeste's room? I started to tell you who I truly was when I heard you leave. Yes, I had another vision. I kept scratching and yelling your name, but nothing would make you come back. So, as I was trying to figure out how I could escape from the room so I could explain myself to you, I felt a presence behind me. No, you don't mean it. Yes, Lydia. I came face to face with the ghost of the school. <laughs> I hid under the bed. I was scared like I've never been before. After a few minutes with nothing happening, I took a peek into the room. The ghost had vanished and the door was open. Yeah, visto la muerta, es bueno, es so I found buena. my courage and went looking for you. I was worried. I found you in the teleport room using one of them to come here. So I followed. La verdad, Zack, ¿quién o qué eres? Honestly, Zack, who or what are you? Uh, I'm not a teacher's familiar. And I never was a dragon either. I'm human, just like you. Just one student among the hundreds of others living in this academy. Me has querido convencerme de que eres un dragón. Que no me has dicho que conocías a Celeste. Celeste. Why didn't you tell me you knew Celeste? Because when I saw you were a new student, I hoped we would become friends, since you didn't know me yet. What does that have to do with you knowing Celeste? Claro. Everything. I knew that as soon as you found Celeste, you would forget about me. <laughs> Tonto. Zach. So I decided to say nothing of Celeste to keep your attention on me, hoping you might forget her. Pero But I realize carajos. now that all those lies cost me the only chance I had to become your friend. You know, Zack, it is possible to have more than one friend at the <laughs> same time. And even when Celeste and I are reunited, we can be friends. 
Me explicarás ahora qué ha pasado en este lugar abandonado. Bueno, antes lo del dragón, ¿por qué? Why did you try to convince me you were a dragon? I, you know, because of my looks, I never really had any friends in my life. It has always been like this since I was young. Kids get laughing at me instead of trying to get to know me. Dragons are so beautiful and everyone respects them. I figured that if I could become a dragon, people would have no choice but to show me respect. En realidad, sí. en so I started to work on a shape-shifting potion. So that was your notebook we found? Mm, surprise. Yes. Okay. No one forced me to drink the potion, Lydia. I did it myself. Sí, porque estabas encerrado. That still doesn't explain why you were locked up. After I drank my potion, I fell unconscious, just as I did after I drank the potion you brewed for me. When I woke up, I was locked up in the wooden case where you found me, with students laughing about what they'd just done to me. They left a few minutes after saying it was time to go somewhere, and I haven't heard or seen anyone else, other than you, since. Mm-hmm. Qué casual. Now, can you tell me what happened in this cursed place? Creo que no lo sabe. I honestly don't know, Lydia. It must have happened while I was locked up. Didn't you hear anything during your confinement? No, nothing. This is all so weird. Then I will need your help, my friend. We must find what happened here and try to save everyone if they are in danger. My friend? Now that sounds good. Quiero que te quedes como lobo o gato, eh. We better keep going. But from now on, no more lies. You'll tell me everything you know about dragón. Mola más. I promise, my friend. My friend, ya veremos. Sabía que era mentirosillo. Me prefiero como lobo o gato, no. Como humano, no, no creo yo que que ya no es posible amistad. Vamos a echar un ojo por aquí. This is where I brewed my shape shifting potion. Ajá. Hey, let's see if we can make another one. Oh no, not until we get a valid recipe or we find out what was wrong with the first one. Claro. Uy. Perdón. Let's brew another potion, Lydia. No estamos preparados. Oh no. Not until we get a valid recipe or we find out what was wrong with the first one. Y vamos a mirar por aquí. Se supone. No hay nada. A ver. Aquí, la placa. Now that's interesting. Zack, have you ever read this plate? Yeah, I gave it a look during my alchemy classes. It says that ingredients can be substituted when brewing potions, but it's all lies. Why? When I brewed my own potion, I couldn't find the hidden flower, so I took a piece of bark from the tree and thinking it would work because of this stupid plate. I knew it was you. <laughs> yes. I'm guilty. Todos, todas. Well, you will come back with me to see Alvandar and apologize to him. Sí. I will, Lydia. So as I was saying, after I drank the potion, I wasn't changed into a dragon like I was supposed to. Instead, I changed into a wolf. If you would have read this all the way to the end, you would have never drank that potion. What are you talking about? It is written here, and I quote, Magical ingredients can be substituted in potions, except when brewing invisibility and shape-shifting brews. <laughs> no way! Are you kidding? I'm totally serious. Darn. Well, I guess we can take this as a good sign. If we find more ingredients, we can brew potions and try until I turn back into a human. Qué fiesta, la fiesta de las pociones. Nos vamos de aquí usando este teleport. ¿Cómo 
How come this teleport pad is working and the last one I tried wasn't? It's a bit tricky. I'll explain what I know when we reach the main teleport room. And where is this main teleport room? I'm not sure exactly, but if we follow the working teleport pads, we'll end up in it eventually. Mm. Así que seguimos teleportándonos. Uh. Esta es entonces. Talk about luck. This is the room I meant. Now let's just find a way to get down to the bottom floor. Aquí abajo. Mm. Porque este tiene tres puntitos. Vamos a usar este teleport, ¿vale? Now tell me what can be useful to know about this room, Zack. All of the teleport pads are controlled from here. Teachers can lock or unlock them using the device which is surrounding us. Tenemos que activarlas. What must we do to unlock all of the teleport pads? That I have no clue about. Only the teachers know how this works. The only thing I can add is that the teleport pads are separated by colors, as you've probably already noticed. <laughs> this allows the teachers to control where the students can or can't go. Parece que están activadas las amarillas. Habría que activar los otros dos colores. Vamos a numerar esto, que es lo que podemos tocar, ¿vale? Este será el 1, que es donde ha ido Lidia, ¿vale? 1, 2, 3 y 4. Vale, el orden es... 1, 2 y 3. 3, 2, 2, 2, 1, 4. ¿Vale? Entonces le damos 3. A ver si funciona. Ahora vamos a aquí. Ya estaban activadas. Nos vamos al 2. Y le tenemos que dar 3 veces. ¿Vale? 2. Le damos una vez. Unlock the red teleport pads. Venga, que me lia, Zack. Dos. Uh, Lydia, I think you've locked them all. Oh, jeez. Venga, y una vez más. Y tres. Porque este orden, pues, para poder hacerlo. You've unlocked the blue teleport pads. Ahora le damos al 1 y al 4 y supuestamente habremos terminado. You've unlocked both the red and blue teleport pads. Y ahora el 4 una vez. Supuestamente ya está. Nice. You've unlocked all the teleport packs. Ahí está. Ya lo tenemos activado. Bueno, aquí termina el capítulo de activando las puertas. Ya están todos los portales activados. Y el siguiente capítulo que nos espera es el búho y el fantasma. Al menos el fantasma parece bueno. El búho, sabemos, nos está espiando. Hasta aquí el capítulo. Muchas gracias por haber llegado hasta aquí. Espero que os haya servido la guía. Nos vemos en próximos. Cuidaros. Saludos y buen juego.